Hi friends, welcome to Linux Excel. Today we are going to see about firewall on Ubuntu. Ubuntu uses uncomplicated firewall. This is an application to manage an IP tables based firewall on Ubuntu. This is a default firewall configuration tool on Ubuntu. It provides user friendly way to configure the firewall. The commands are so simple and easy to remember. UFW supports both IPv4 and IPv6. Ok friends, let's see some basic commands for UFW. First, you are going to enable the UFW. The command is UFW enable. Click enter. It will show firewall is active and enabled on a system startup. If you want to check the status, the command is UFW status. See the status is active now. Okay, let's see how to add a rule in VFW. The first command I am going to see is how to add a SSH port number. This is the command VFW allow and the port number of SSH is 22. Give enter. It shows rules added here. V6 means IPv6. The rule added to IPv6 also. Let's see the status. Here the rule is added to both IPv4 and IPv6. In UFW, we have added a rules in numbered format also. This is the command to add a rule in numbered format. UFW insert one allow 80. Click enter. This command shows that allow the port number 80 and place that rule in number 1 position. We have to check it with the status. It shows in number 1 position. We can also check the status in this command also. EFW status number. This will show the number of this rule. The 80 rule is applied in number 1 position. If you want to deny any port number, the command is UFW deny 25. It will execute it. Now check for the status the rule is added or not. See, the rule is added. The port number 25 is denied to anywhere. If you want to delete any rules, the command is UFW delete and then delete 25. Click enter. Rule is deleted. Check for the status. Full shows the rule is deleted. Next command is how to allow a specific IP address. This is the command UFW allow from any IP address. And click enter. The rule is added. If you want to allow any specific IP address to specific port number means the command is UFW allow from IP address to mention the specific port number. Here I mentioned 22. Click enter. Rule is added. Now check for the status. These two commands are recently added. If we want to allow the subnet of IP address, the command is UFW allow from IP address and also mention the subnet mask and click enter. The rule is added. Now check for the status. The rule is added. In this subnet, it will allow anywhere. Next command we are going to see is how to delete a rule using rule number. First, we are going to see the number of the rules here. Now, I am going to delete rule number 6. That is, port 80 allow to anywhere. The command is UFW delete and then rule number. It will ask for a permission to delete. Then, UY and then enter. Now, the rule is deleted. Now, check for the status. Now the rule number 6 is deleted. 
here the new rule is added in that number next we are going to see is how to use UFW in application integration first command we are going to see in this UFW app list here these are the active applications running currently in the system now I am going to allow Samba application the rule is UFW allow Samba click enter rule is added we can also give a specific IP range to access the Samba the command is UFW allow from IP address and to any app and then application name Samba I am giving Samba here the rule is added now check for the status it will shows here see the Samba is allowed to anywhere and then here the specific IP range we can see the application information through VFW the command is VFW app info I am giving Samba here it will show the application information these are all the basic commands of uncomplicated firewall on Ubuntu thanks for watching the video please subscribe to our youtube channel Linux Help. for further tutorial visit www.linuxhelp.com any queries mail us to support at linuxhelp.com